all right guys what's going on guys it's your boy Cree back at it again with another borderlands 3 video and this borderlands 3 video doing another weapon showcase guys this time on the gargoyle uh this is a def this is a world drop uh, or yeah this is definitely a world drop in the dlc although there is a uh there is a, like a crew challenge uh, i think for the dedicated drop for this one uh i can't quite remember which area it is on Ginna. Uh, but regardless, it's, it's, you can, it can still drop uh, just like out there in the DLC regardless in the Bounty of Blood. Uh, here it is, a COV pistol. Uh, this is the one that I got to drop for us uh, yesterday while doing another showcase video, ironically. Uh, we got about 5,800 5, damage times 2. Uh, really awesome, a uh, really set respectable accuracy. Uh, handling repair time, uh, fire rate, and shots to break. 2% uh, uh, critical damage with a 109% weapon damage. Uh, awesome. 50% uh, fire rate uh, is pretty solid. And then after exiting Iron Bear, uh, we have the 160 splash anointment for 18 seconds, which is very, very uh, good, obviously. Um, real quick, let's go ahead and show uh, what we're using here. A double capstone build. Now, I don't know if Forge actually works with COV weapons. Real quick, I'm going to sh uh, shoot. Okay. Nah, there's no point going into Forge. Okay, I'm actually going to go to Sanctuary. And uh, I'm going to respec because there's literally no point to having Forge. And that's just a complete waste um, of a skill point. So I'll be right back. Okay, guys, so we're back. Uh, I went ahead and actually maxed out Drowning and Brass instead of using Forge. Uh, real quick, I'll show you what I'm talking about. Um, here is the, uh, the Gargoyle. You know what I'm saying? I ain't changing. We gotta give this thing a showcase. Here it is, though. Uh, so we go some for the some for the road, and then Specialist Bear maxed out Scorching RPMs, and then uh, yeah, we maxed out Drowning and Brass instead of going for Forge. So yeah, uh, this tree, the Demolition Woman tree, still stays the same. But on that, uh, yeah. With that being said, though, guys, we're gonna go ahead and get right into it. Uh, let's go. Oh yeah, we're using a Blastmaster. Um, along with, uh, I think, a Radiation, yeah, Radiation Old God, and a Cloning Matting Tracker. With the Pearl, you already know it. And, yeah, let's go ahead and get right into it. Alright. 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 I don't like what I'm seeing so far. Just a little bit. Oh, yeah, screw you, Stealth Commando. You suck. You can, you can hold that. Oh, okay. Okay. Excuse me, big fella. Excuse me, big fella. I heard uh, y'all ordered some of the gargoyle. All right. Well, here it is. It's pretty nasty, huh? Uh. Okay. All right. All right. All right, you monstrous thing. Okay. So far, uh, I'm actually really impressed with this thing. Oh. Oh. Okay. Okay. All right. I. So you're going to do that. I really can't wait to see what this thing does against Wotan. That's going to be really interesting. Dude, I love Hammer Down Protocol on Iron Bear, honestly. <laughs> that shit's so sick. Yeah, I do. Okay. Right. Okay, dude. Um. Okay. Okay. Oh, you shouldn't have backed up off me, homie. You just sealed your own fate. Bye. Bye, gargoyle. This thing's stupid. Finna drop a nuke, bitch! Look at this thing's damage! <laughs> like, what? They, they, uh, I ever kill him. Kill you. Turn around. Spray the gun out. Pull the string. Kill you. Where's he at? Where's the main course dish? Here he is. What's up later, bitch? Sorry. You can't handle the gargoyle. Oh, well, you can if I miss. 
Nah, sit down. Okay, alright, thing. Alright. Alright, gargoyle. Okay, I see you. I see you. I see you. I'm gonna check this loot real quick, see if it's anything worse than uh, picking up a Jericho. I don't want no dang Jericho. And then a Super Bowl. Okay, guys. Alright, alright. So far, uh, my initial impressions of the gargoyle is, is that this thing's kind of freaking insane. It's uh, pretty disgustingly good. Um, it's making some absolute massive light work of these of these guardians uh, we're gonna go ahead and do the door skip real quick so i'll go ahead and cut on over uh, to that um excuse me fellas but uh i'm kind of in the middle of something it's called a showcase video look at this thing this thing's a filthy son of a gun isn't it can i snipe the desk here no i cannot Wow. Check out that body I mean, this this thing is not going to have any problems putting in massive work. Like, this thing has no problem right now putting in massive work. I mean, this thing is actually outputting some massive mad amounts of damage. And it's like killing everything, dude. This thing being corrosive is so, like, so strong. I also have a consecutive version of this thing, too, which is, uh, something not to scoff at as well. And this is another COV weapon, bro. Yeah, they've been, they've been really trying to give us some good, uh, COV weapons. Hit them. Yeah, look at the hammer down protocol snipe. Those bastards. A head count. Sorry, buddy, but you just, uh, you can't step to this thing. It's just ain't possible. All the corrosive enemies, please stand up so I can immediately melt you. Oh, dang, bro. You had no health, so you were just trying to jump and save your life, but you just weren't able to. This thing is stupid. Yes, I mean we're moving, we're moving straight to Wotan. Uh, <laughs> this thing is by f is, is totally, totally a menace, dude. I mean, I feel like I've said that about almost all the Jacob's DLC weapons, but I mean Jacob's DLC weapons, all the Bounty of Blood DLC weapons, but like it's just kind of facts, like. I mean, dude, they're all good. We just did a video on the Miscreeton, and, like, that thing was a complete menace. We come over to the Gargoyle, and now this thing is completely shredding. Like, look at this thing. Like, this thing is just com- I mean, it's just making Wotan, like, look like Swiss cheese. He's quivering in his, in his boots and his armor. I don't know, bro. He's quivering, though. Look at this poor guy. He doesn't even know what to make of it. Oh, immunity phases. Oh, there he goes. I guess this thing has a travel limit. Okay, that's good to know, I guess. Not enough space. Oh, look at the hammer down protocol. Oh, I got a pretty bad spawn on that. Look at this, dude. Wow. Oh. Oh. All right, let's just get to shredding. Come on, quit moving. Quit, yes. Excuse me, but uh, I have a little snipe. Oh my God. <laughs> Take down confirmed. This thing melted Wotan. Oh. This thing melted Wotan. Let's kill these Krakens. Hello. 
Yeah, not like these guys are posing any threats. No, he just kind of dies instantly. Oh, that was not a long Wotan fight at all. Sorry, have to send you out like that. All right, guys. Well, the quick. I guess we'll do a quick look at the uh, the, set, the setup that we went for. So here's the gargoyle, right? A complete absolute menace. Uh, this thing completely shits on everything. Um, <laughs> uh, that's just the only way I can really put it. We're using a blast master. Uh, splash and pistol damage is the only important things you need to know about it. Uh, also, the one in redistribution is important. Uh, radiation old god. A cloning matting tracker. Very very solid. I'm Pearl of ineffable knowledge. Uh, once again, uh, I do have a second one of these with a consecutive anointment, so that's also really, really good. A uh, demolition woman tree. Yeah, dude. Short fuse with this thing is a complete, uh, an absolute menace. And this bombless mag tree is actually performs pretty solid, along as uh, having five and a drowning in brass. Now with the uh, three skill points is awesome. Anyways, though, guys, hope you enjoyed the video. My name's Cree, and I'll see y'all on the next one. Peace out, everybody.